Alrighty guys, this is Arrow Gaming and today we are going to be playing some more Kerrigan Survival and this time I'm going to go for some scientist action because I recently remembered a really OP tactic most of the pros actually use whenever they are playing against other high level zergs and I'm going to show you what that is in just a second. Okay, let me see. So basically what you do is you get structures like right over here in the in the intersection between like two cliff slides can you see this so this is a cliff and then you go on the low ground and you build two structures like this and this so you have two and then you also get a flashlight because in case your SUV gets stuck out of it okay we have a Kerrigan nice in case you get the SUV stuck out of it, you can actually go back and you can uh, like blink it back because if you cannot see that terrain, then you cannot blink it back. So you need like two of these and then one sensor tower and then you're good to go. And the thing is, this way of getting income is a lot safer than the other ones. And you can use the scientists to just farm, to farm like very effectively. Okay, like this. And you need 5 Reapers to one shot a Zergling, by the way, in case you didn't know. Now I can get like, okay, I did get 2 Chrono Boosts, and now you just upgrade your stuff. I mean, this way, you risk a lot less, theoretically, because in practice, if those get found, you'll need to replace them, like over and over again. This is why it's really important where you choose to put these, because they need to be as uh, far from other ramps as possible. I'm gonna sh like tell you what I mean in just a second. So for example, if you put it like right over here, it's gonna be very close to this ramp. And that will increase the chance that you will get found. So that is why you don't want to do that. Don't want to put them like next to very like populated ramps. So I have 18 gas, 18 extra gas. Because as you can see, most of my stuff is chrono boosted and I've got 20 gas, so this is amazing. I'm gonna build another one of these outposts, I'm gonna get it here. And yes, it's riskier, but it's not as risky as, for example, this place, which is very close to a ramp. And this way my income should theoretically be like very safe. And also you don't need to put any structures on this block on the very corner, because that way these zerglings will be able to see it. So that's why you never want to do that. You always want to get them like next to the corner. So this one got found. My SCV is going to repair it. Now the Zerg should run away. What? What is he doing? Okay, okay, this is weird. Please go away, Mr. Zergling. Okay, see? Now it's out. And now I can actually build more stuff. I can build more structures. Same with this one. I'm gonna get a tower here, now I'm gonna bling the SV back in, I'm gonna upgrade this and then I'm gonna, I'm just gonna sit there with the SV. so this is how you do it, this is how you just replace them over and over again, this does require more APM than like a regular strategy, but I would say that if you wanna be safe, it's like 100% worth it, it's just worth it, okay I'm gonna chrono boost these, Okay, our wind chance is still very low by the way. We have kind of a 30% wind chance, which is bad by the way. That means we are at a very big disadvantage. I got a second outpost which is right over there. And you don't need a lot of these, you only need like a, like a couple, four or five maximum. You can even do it with like two of them, but I suggest trying more. Okay. I could also go for like one over here, even though this is close to creep, it could work for a while. So I'm gonna get this, this and this, this is how you do it. Third outpost. The thing is you don't wanna put it in places that can be passed by Kerrigan. If Kerrigan is likely to go like next to a place, you don't wanna get your outpost in there. Because that's like very risky. Again, hotkey this, chrono boost upgrade. Okay. Now we have all of them ready. Now we have three different outposts in three different locations, which is what we want. We want them to be as far from each other as possible so that Kerrigan does not have any clue as to why 
or where your income could possibly be. Now next, let me see where do I get the next one. I need to choose carefully. Oh no, that got scanned. Okay, see? This is like the big risky thing. You can actually lose all of it. You can lose it in a second if Kerrigan figures out what's going on. So this is why you might also wanna like mix it up. You wanna get like a couple of corner ones and then maybe a couple of ones that are not next to corners. So that you are well balanced. Because you can also lose this very easily. Wait, what? Okay, okay. I thought that for a second the Kerrigan was on top of me. I mean, now we have the outposts. So we could actually start looking for Kerrigan. Because now I just need to keep my stuff alive. Yeah, good question. Where's Kerrigan? Is she AFK? I mean, if she's AFK, then we're going to get tons of ELO. So that would be amazing, but I don't think that's the case. Okay, I'm gonna get these like that, so that they are safe from potential Hydras. Okay, I got this outpost. Now I need to go away. I'm gonna get some gates to be extra safe. Okay, there she is. Oh boy, no way. He's blocked, wait, what? Okay, Elementalist died somehow. That was weird, he got like blocked over there. Yeah, I'm gonna go for another outpost like this. I can even get like two more of these structures. I'm gonna teleport the SCV back. Really? How are they dying like this? Okay, this is not good. <laughs> this is bad. This is really bad. Whenever your teammates are dying like this, it means that either Kyrgyz is really good or they are really bad. <laughs> now I can see the backlash from Kerrigan having such a high win chance. I'm gonna need to just get more Reapers, because I can do it. Go Reapers, farm. I need to use Reapers until it's too late, because if the Zerg gets upgraded, then it's gonna be basically impossible to win with Reapers, or to farm with Reapers. We don't want that to happen. I'm gonna send them away. I'm gonna get a Medivac. And I'm gonna leave. Now I wanna be extra safe. And I want to upgrade all of this to plus 8 before I go to plus 16s. Because this is the best way to do it. Now where do I go? I need to go where my income is not. I need to be as far away from my income as possible at all times. Because this is the best way to do this. But where do I go? That's my question. I mean Kerrigan's gotta be top. Okay, there she is. She is top. Nice. Who else do we have? Not many. I'm gonna lose that. Yeah, the bad thing about this is that you do risk losing them. Yeah, the sensor tower does stop you from like repairing your stuff. So it's kind of annoying. But it is what it is. I almost wish these structures did give you some vision so that you can back you can like get back to them each time you need to. I'm gonna send away Reapers again. Because I could use some more farming. I'm gonna get plus one, even though I don't really need a whole lot more gas, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Oh, come on! Again! I'm gonna have to, se to like <coughs> salvage both of, both of these. As you can see... Oh no, what? Wait, what? All my Reapers died. Okay, no, no, go back, Zergling. You're bad. They have Hydras, okay. Now as you can see, this one that is theoretically safer got attacked a lot less than the other. Okay, that one got salvaged, which is nice. But I'm gonna get found a lot of times. Because this is like the nature of the strategy. You're gonna get destroyed a lot of times. Okay, I'm gonna go... I have plus one attack, so this is nice. My Reapers can still like farm. Now I think it's time to think of a base, of a basing spot, but where? Okay, that one is perfect. That one place is amazing. Okay, I only have like a couple of outposts, like two. I'm kind of losing them. I could actually go for a corner one right over here. 
Okay, run. Okay, I'm gonna run with the Reapers. Go away, guys. No, run. Run, don't attack. Run. I'm gonna leave like one SCV in here and then run away with the medivac. Oh, come on. As soon as I like build it, it dies. That's unfortunate. Are we basing? No. I can base. I can base, bro. No caps. I can base. Because I have the income, but I need the team. Yeah, mini base. That's what I'm talking about. We could get like a mini base. I'm gonna get it right over here. Okay, I could get some bunkers. Okay, I'm gonna get the I'm gonna use the W for the bunkers. And then I'm gonna need a lot more income. Where's Kerrigan by the way? I have my Q on rapid fire, this is kind of annoying. Okay, I'm gonna get tons of income right over here like this. Cause I can. Oh there she is, there is Kerrigan. Oh boy, this is gonna be difficult. I'm gonna have to spam stuff like ghosts. Go ghosts! Destroy them! I'm gonna also have to spam like some marauders too. I mean, I know this is gonna be hard to do. Oh, oh, we're doing it! We're getting her, I'm gonna have to spam some firebase too. I mean, she's taking lots of damage. Okay, go firebase, get her! Destroy her! Yes, the guard is right over there. Okay. I can just spam her with stuff. No, 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 no! Run, scientist, run! I need to run. Okay, boost away. Boost, 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 boost. Oh, she's kind of stuck. No, it was Descendant. Yeah, well... Oh, that base got destroyed, no! I heard that. No, I only have like one outpost. I've got like a single outpost right now. So this is not great. I mean, she did take damage. Where did she go? She teleported. I'm afraid she's next to me. Did she just retreat? Yeah, I think she did. Okay. We need to get a base. I'm gonna need to fix my medivac. Go guys, I can see Zagara but not Kerrigan. So that kind of worries me. Okay. Wait, what? She did not go for the base. I don't... I have ghosts. I have tons of ghosts here ready to defend. Where's Kerrigan? I need to see Kerrigan. Okay, there she is. I can actually go for a base in the corner. Because she's distracted right now. This is the perfect moment. Okay, my ghosts there are doing, are doing just a great job at defending. Okay, upgrade all of these and then I could even upgrade these because I can afford it, yeah. I can afford it, no problem. Kerrigan is right there, I don't think they will be paying attention at me going there, like right over there. To base, for like a second base. Oh, look at my income. I have so much, including the one in here. Okay, thank you for the donation. 1,200 minerals. Not bad. That is not bad. I'm gonna need like tons of marauders and ghosts upgraded. I don't think she knows I'm here. Okay, there she is. She's actually gonna go for this side of my income. Okay. Oh, 3,600, now we're talking. This is real money. Yes. Oh, run, Stukov, run. I'm gonna need you in the base. I cannot base by myself. I'm gonna get some ghosts and some SCVs to give me stuff. I'm gonna need SCVs for... It says GG. No, why GG? We can do this. Come on, guys. We can do this. What a good team. Scanned? Did that get scanned? Is that a thing? Okay, okay. He just, like, scanned me so that he could say I can carry. Yeah, I can try and carry. 
but I'm not promising anything because I'm still alone I'm still like on my own okay I have ghosts I just need to spam more ghosts and like fire bet fire bet marauder is like the ultimate combo for a scientist where's Kerga by the way is she there please tell me that's Kerga no that's not her she's gonna try to break me that's what I'm saying I have tons of income now Whew, this is going decently well but it's still gonna be very difficult to win the game okay there she is there she is okay go marauders marauders no way no that's so hard that's like so hard to do go ghost and marauders get her that was so dirty by her she almost killed me go fire bats he's gonna try to break me here I mean that is not my income fortunately if that were my income if that were like all of my income I would have died long ago go ghosts go ghosts destroy her go okay okay I'm doing pretty well now look at my gas bro 500 gas that's like significant okay go ghosts I need to spam ghosts now I have swan with me this is nice I'm gonna have to go on the offense and I'm gonna need more vision okay I have the max supply she's gonna be looking for my income okay I can go for more income in here like this and then some more vision like this I'm going to send this uh, away do I have an upgrading structure yes I do have one okay I'm gonna need more vision here okay I'm gonna need what else marauder damage I'm gonna need like the steam pack go guys Wait, what is that Kerrigan? I thought that was Kerrigan for a second, but no, that's not her. What is it you need? Okay. Research. What number? I'm not sure what they're asking, but I just want to make sure I don't die. There she is, there is Kerrigan. What is she trying to do there? Go, guys, get her. Get him. Focus Kerrigan, focus Kerrigan. Okay, go, get her, boys. Okay, yes, teleport away, run away, bro cannot do this you're too weak okay thanks for the support guys this is nice but I still doubt I'll be able to win this on my own because this is gonna be hard AF go guys I'm gonna have to send my units away okay I do have like tons of ghosts I'm gonna need like the range ghost upgrade okay it will increase my range by three and the ghost range by three that is nice I'm not I don't have three three which kind of worries me go guys go destroy them Swan get rockets yeah he could use some rockets I'm gonna need the towers to detect okay nice now what else what should I go for should I go like fire bat marauder yeah I think I, I could do this and then I could send this on the offense go guys destroy them I also could go for some vision on my units because I don't really have vision okay vision goggles not bad I'm gonna have to spam like marauders and stuff I send like half my army to the offense it is not the best thing to do but is the only chance we have okay they have songs they do have songs okay what is Selendis doing wait do we have a Selendis are you serious bro she's afk and the Kerrigan is towards me is going towards me I'm gonna need tons of ghosts to do this and marauders to tank the banings the like banning hits okay there they are the banings ok 
Okay, I can see Kerrigan right over there. She's gonna try to break the stuff while... Oh boy, go get her, boys! Okay, get Kerrigan. Focus her. Okay. Go destroy Kerrigan, guys! Focus Kerrigan, no! No, no! Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I'm gonna spam Marauders. Go Marauders, yes! No way, no! No, 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 no way! I died! Oh my god! Oh no! No, this is so close! Destroy her! That was so close! She's at 800 HP! How did she not die? Oh man. Where is Selendis? Where is Selendis? Okay, Bailings Phantom. Yeah, we're gonna need Bailings. On carry. <laughs> yes, go. We need Bailings. We need like tons of Bains. Okay, there she is. Go Bailing. Yes. She took damage. Bro, what are you doing? No, no, we can win this. The ghosts can win this. Okay, where's Kerrigan? She's gonna try to run away. Why in the world would you do that? Okay, they're going towards her. They they saw her. Oh, come on. No, no, don't go. She's going into the scans. I'm gonna need Ghost Nova. This is like the only way I can do this. What is the guy doing, bro? Guys, we need to find Kerrigan ASAP. Okay, where is Kerrigan? Okay, she's sending units. She's not actually sending uh, herself, you know? Oh man, I cannot believe how close this is. Where is she? Where is Kerrigan? We need to find her. Can for carry. Okay, there she is, there she is, I can see her. Okay, go bailing. No! Why would you give me minerals, bro? Why would you like ever give me minerals? Okay, go after her, guys. No! Why are you going that way? They can see her. This is like the bad thing. They can actually see her. No! <laughs> GG. I mean, good game, well played.